Hello everyone, this is Deviant Fun with, well, a short review video. We haven't done any uh, for quite a while. Um, must confess, it's it's easier to find uh, reviews on on the net and and share. But uh, today uh, I thought it would be more interesting to, as I show you this book because we we haven't sh shown it yet. Uh, as we leaf through, uh, I thought I could talk a little bit about it. So, uh, first of all, so what we're talking is uh, Seven to Eternity. This uh, little beauty that you're seeing here is a Portuguese edition uh, that collects all the three volumes, the ones that are that, are, that have been put out. So that it's all the story that there is at the moment in the market. Uh, yeah, so they've called it book one. Um, so Seven to Eternity is by, is a book by Rick Remender and illustrated by Jerome Peña, uh, uh, a partner of his. Uh, they, they do a lot of work together. The Agent, for example. So what does Seven to Eternity uh, talk about? Well, uh, the name Seven to Eternity comes from the number of of uh, beings. Let's call them beings because this this uh, includes a lot of race, different races from humans to other creatures like goblins and wizards and things like that. So it has a bit of high fantasy with uh, strange creatures, uh, potions, magic, and stuff like that. If you're not into it, like I am not very much into magic and uh, magic swords, magic uh, vision that comes from an artifact and etc. Well, uh, let me tell you that even still you'll, you'll super enjoy this book because I, I, I quite, quite, quite like it. And still it has a lot of that. But uh, the main... Uh, the good news is that the main uh, purpose, the main uh, subject on this book is not magic or, or whatever. The, the magic and the, the different world and, well, that's more for, for uh, Jerome Peña to shine, to shine through. But uh, Remander has another agenda uh, on this book and he wants us he wants us to experience uh, the um, the journey, physical journey that this 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 group uh, starts. They're searching for something. I'm not going to get into much detail. Uh, they have to go across across the land to find something to get rid of, a, let's say, a curse. Uh, they have this character, the Lord of the Mud, which you can see here, uh, which has almost uh, entrailed all of the of the world with his whispers, and that's about the book. is more about this whis the whisper power, and what and the, the whispers are presented as something magical, but they're none other than uh, a metaphor for uh, the, hum the human, or in this case, humans, humanoids, and whatever, um, morals, and uh, how easy it is to change your morals due to circumstances, how how everyone has its price, no matter how strong his beliefs are, and uh, how much he proclaims that those those values are sacred to him or whatever. Uh, so what you will experience through this book, and that's cleverly done, is that you'll you'll end up not knowing. Wait, wasn't this the good guy uh, but is now doing this and the bad guy is doing the opposite so who the hell is the bad guy and who the hell is the good guy so it, it, to summarize this book shows you that 
we're all intrinsically bad and we can all be intrinsically good also, right? It's more the circumstances that 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 th throw us uh, left or right. And so what you see here is uh, the quest of the main character. Mainly, it's it's focused on the, on Adam Osiris, uh, who comes from a family uh, that is accused of being treasonous, uh, uh, and and one of the one of the fellow one of, one of the members of the fellowship. Um, keeps saying that he's going to mess it all up because his family is no good and he won't be different from anyone in his family and she might be right uh, maybe not it's hard to say but when you read it you can you can make your own judgment uh, and I think there's a lot of room here to to accommodate each person's view when you see the, the characters changing and acting out of character well actually they're not but uh, you weren't expecting them to take that path and they do well you might be sympathetic with it or you might say oh what a fake what a fake this guy or this 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 woman is uh, so I believe the experience will be different uh, for uh, different readers, but I, it's guaranteed that when you finish the book, uh, you won't be looking at the at the characters the same way you looked at at the beginning of the book. So that's that that journey is guaranteed. So this is an an excellent an excellent book by Remander. Uh, if you have never read Remander, well, uh, this. His type of writing, at least in this book, can lend a bit to more... I wouldn't say literary, because I don't want to scare you off, for those who don't like to read prose. But it has some, almost uh, like if you were reading uh, philosophical quotes uh, uh, from a, a um, philosophy book or something like that, uh, with that type of ancient um, language uh, but uh, with meta with lots of metaphors and and old sayings and things like that but it, it, it does really um, add up to the to the environment that Opeña uh, creates here all weird all mystical uh, so uh, just to say that it's not that kind of that of simple chit chat dialogue it's it's got some hidden meanings and some uh, some sugar to it right it's sugary um so that's it uh i'm glad that we have this this incredible hardcover version here in portugal for all of you guys who aren't portuguese or don't understand portuguese I'm sorry guys hope you have it you have similar editions in your country um yeah i wish you could you could have it in this way this of course uh almost shouts for a hardcover are oversized but yeah uh, we can't be too too greedy yeah huh? this this edition is very 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 good so you can buy the if you port if you know portuguese if you understand portuguese i meant uh you can buy this book at the event fun uh, otherwise, we can get you the, uh, the three volumes, of course, in, in English. So stop by deviantfun.biz, see all the all the stuff we've got there for you. It's not just books. Uh, at least if you go to our Facebook and Instagram and YouTube, YouTube, you'll have news and and uh, uh, well. You can you can see what's going to to hit the market in the next in the next months so that's that's kind of interesting okay uh won't talk uh, much more now uh that's enough uh thank you for watching so stay tuned and until the next video bye bye